<laughs> well, well. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to the show. Where, you know. Uh, anyway, uh, my next guest has uh, got a show called Only in America, which is Wednesdays on the History Channel. Is it Hitler? <laughs> Every time I watch the History Channel, it's Hitler. <laughs> No way he's here. I wouldn't have him on. No. I'd rather have uh -oh. Kardashian than Hitler. <laughs> it can't be. It can't be. It can't be. Well, take a look at this. We'll see. I'm good to get down, boss. You gotta do what you gotta do. Now, do you always gotta do this kind of a move? Because I'm not comfortable with that move. the clip <laughs> at least it wasn't hitler I, well that is true yeah and i'm so sorry you had to see that no i apologize no that's a lot of people uh, are into that there's, I, there's websites for that kind of thing <laughs> if somebody's getting off on that they got problems no no no, no, no. it's just it's just a whole it, it, there's a whole kind of, never mind no, what the hell you, are you doing what's this tell me larry the cable guy on the history channel god bless america right mm -hmm. that's like that, that's almost like Charlie Sheen doing commercials for eHarmony. <laughs> <laughs> what well, are you doing in the History Channel? Well, I'm doing a show called Only in America. Mm -hmm. And I'm going around the country just telling everybody, hey, we live in a great country. This is the greatest country in the world. And I'm going out and I'm interviewing people and I'm doing things. And, and you're activity. underpants all the time? Right? Well, this was a story I'd done. This is a story I'd done on the Naked Cowboy. The guy in, in New York. This is a guy, this only in America, this is work. This, this is a guy that wanted to be famous. Yeah. Didn't know how to do it, so he put on a pair of underbridges, went down to Times Square with a guitar, started singing. Next thing you know, he's pulling in about $500,000 a year, going down there singing in his underbridge. Stop it, 500? Yeah. But you really? So I go down there. I'm out of here, so long, suckers. <laughs> I know. <laughs> And, really? Uh, that's right. Well, we got to see you naked. You may not make that much, but... Uh, <laughs> I, 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 can, I can take Tonto with me, though, and I would do it. I mean, I made about five bucks that day. But, well. but I went down there just to check it out. I want to be a part of it. And that's what this show is about. Only in America, greatest country in the world. If you work hard, you, you can achieve your dreams. Well, and, but, but, What's working hard about putting on your underpants and going well, singing? He, That's not a day at the no, work, man. Well, That's look, a, that guy gets up at 5.30 in the morning. He goes down there, and he that's all he and that's what he does. He makes a, a, People just give him tips, and that's how much money he makes. He's down there all day long. But it's just that... That's the Why show. Don't why, why? It's a it, it's a feel good show. So I went down right. and that's what I did. I did I did the show with him. It was the most humiliating thing I've ever done in my entire life. And uh, I'll never till, do it again. Till I, now. Well, look, it used to be fun for me. I used to be in shape. I lost my wife two years ago. Got me a trainer, and I lost uh, forty pounds trying to uh, avoid that some bitch. And. Uh, <laughs> I was jumping and stuff. I never sweated so much in my life. Last time I sweated that much, I got my wife pregnant. Hey. But, uh, but I try to lose weight. You know, I really do. I went in. To, it's just tough, you know. Yes, it's it is. I've done it. And, yeah. That's right. And uh, I remember I went to a dietitian one time. He goes, well, what you need to do is you need to eat six times a day. And I'm like, I do that now. All right. <laughs> I mean, I got that licked. If I eat one more time a day, I'm going to end up going to Walmart on a scooter wearing pajama jeans. All right? Hey, hey, I, I love pajama jeans. Pajama <laughs> jeans. Have you got, pajama, you got a pair of pajama jeans? They're yeah. great. They're, it's like wearing your pants in bed. It's the greatest thing it's of really all time. It's really comfortable. Love pajama jeans, especially. Have you, have you got one of them, uh, what do you call them, the, you know, the, the snuglets? The snuggies? Hey, yeah, well, uh, yeah. <laughs> You know what? I, you, I, I don't, and I'll tell you why. If you're too stupid to operate a blanket, all right. <laughs> oh, man, no. I, I can never. That's 
the dumbest invention I ever seen. Are these parts are in the show tonight, the snugglet? All right, good. All right. It, it really, the snuggie, all it is is a robe backward. That's all it is. But only in America. You see what we did? Somebody well, said, all right, I'm going to put a reverse robe. That's and right. I'm going to sell it with a catchy title and make a fortune. That's right. Hey, and I got to tell you, he was talking about porn names earlier. Oh, yes. That doesn't always work, you know. I tried that. My porn name was Snowball 810 14th Street. <laughs> not very that's, sexy. That's, no, that's, Snowball's pretty sexy. If you stop at Snowball and just wear those little teddy whities that'd be awesome. Oh my Gentlemen, God. please welcome Snowball. <laughs> Black Velvet. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Hey, I got to tell you something funny. I, got, I come here. Craig always gives you gifts, so I come in here tonight. And I open it up, and there's uh, vinaigrette salad dressing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> which is a hint. You, I say, he saw my clip. He's giving me a salad no, no, dressing. No, 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 no. But the first time I'd done your show, you gave away little M&Ms with your face on them. <laughs> and you gave away. He did? He did. And so I took those home with my kids for the potty training. And... <laughs> And what? We went home. It's a true story. For going pee, it was one Craig Ferguson. <laughs> and for going poop, it was two Craig Ferguson. <laughs> That's the exact same system we use here. <laughs> so we went. Do you know what my dad did once with M&M's? My dad, my dad once came home and there was a pigeon in the front room. And he was like, oh, I can have a pigeon. And he didn't know what to do. He, was, he didn't know what to do with a pigeon. He was a postman. So he said, he said, he was a what? A postman, you know, a okay. postal, postal worker. So what he did was he put down a little trail of M&Ms and opened the front door. And I, and I come home and I said, what, what are you doing? He said, well, a pigeon will eat the M&Ms and walk out the front door. <laughs> I said, that's not how it works. It didn't work. <laughs> wow, that's... Uh... So they can't all be winners, Larry, I'm just saying. <laughs> Nobody's stealing Just you that. Mentioned, you mentioned the M&M's. I thought I'd break it up. You're right. Nobody's stealing that. Oh, That's right. Man, yeah. That. We've got, we got to take a break. Uh, do you, you, you approve of commercials? Yeah, I do approve of commercials. Well, here's something then. Time, hey, right? can I say this? And I and I ain't blowing smoke up yet. I love doing your show. Thank it is you. so much fun. It's Thank relaxed. You. It's loose. And you know why your show's good? Because you don't care. I don't. <laughs> no. I don't care. That's what I'm saying. I just, you don't care. I, I, if you're watching and you think that this is a bet, I don't I care. <laughs> and, and let me tell you. No, he's right. And and that's what makes a good show. It's like my show, Only in America. You don't care. I hate traveling. I hate being away from my family. Right. I could care less if that show does good or not. And the more I don't care, the better that show yeah, does. That's, that's, <laughs> but you can't screw. fake it. You can't fake it. You've got to genuinely not give a rat's ass. You can't fake yeah, it. And if you really don't give a you're going to do really well. Yeah, that's the way it works. <laughs> All right, so what do you want? A big cash prize, awkward pause, mouth organ, or that's about it? I got to tell you, they told me about this. I wouldn't mind doing the awkward pause. Okay. Do you like the awkward pause? If you want. How about the awkward pause, good? Yeah. 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 I did the awkward pause. It's not, it's not very awkward if you all enjoy it. <laughs> it's going to be awkward. All right, let's get it. Right. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You know, use acting power. That's what the awkward pause is all about. Do your acting. <laughs> Maybe we want to throw something in, like, you know, there's a funny smell or, you know, yeah. something like that. Sure. Smell your finger. <laughs> very, very awkward. <laughs> It's more awkward than I had in mind, actually. But I was like, 